mm-hmm. everybody's like, oh, my mental health, oh, my mental health, looking after, like, you know, and in, in, in one way, I, I, I think it's fantastic because in the past, you would not understand sometimes what was going on. So a label can be very complicated, but sometimes it does help. You know, yeah, sometimes sometimes, it, sometimes yeah. it's all you need is some, some you know, but I, I can see both ways, but, but that was not even my point. The thing, what you said about being Filipino and not having that thing, oh, you know that the family is all right and we'll back you up. Like we're hustling, right? So mm. my reality is quite similar. I'm, I'm doing the exercise of acknowledging my privilege. So like we were never a rich family in Brazil, but mm-hmm. my parents could afford education mm-hmm. for me. And that was, that was good. But like now that I'm an adult, I remember uh, seeing them working nonstop. So we didn't have much time together mm-hmm. because they were giving their lives for so you. I could have something. And, and now I understand mm-hmm. that very well, right? Yeah. Uh, so I'm here. So they, they paid for drumming classes and English classes. Mm. And here I am teaching drums and speaking English, right? So, so, so I'm very grateful for mm. that. And, and I'm so like, I'm doing this exercise of like, you know, it's easy for me to, to complain about things because people around me have much more when it comes to material yeah. stuff. But then here's the catch. Um, a lot of my friends have families and I see them on, and I'm not judging them because it's actually funny sometimes like they freak out because like everything has to be perfect and they have to make sure that they're going to have everything they need for the children. So like, and then I see my parents <laughs> times 10, <laughs> you know, like in the f- coolest country in the world that will back you up, that has benefits, that has like good lifestyle. Of course, if you're a kid, you will complain that you're not Swedish or whatever. Yeah. But like, you know, like, yeah. so, so then I see the wave of mental health mm-hmm. being so, escal- you know, like just different lenses yeah. of a thing. I'm like, I look at them and I'm like, you're fine, bro. <laughs> like you're all good. Like I have no idea what the word savings yeah. means. Like when I tell people, <laughs> when I saying? tell people, when I tell people that everything that you're looking at you guys, like this studio, this magazine, yeah. mm-hmm. when I say that almost 100% of it, it's coming from tailors and in my pocket. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. People laugh. We had people coming here and laughing. They were like, how much are you guys making? And I'm like, <laughs> we're paying, bro. Yeah. We're paying to do this stuff. Yeah. We're paying to put a magazine out. We're paying to put a, 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 yeah. a, a podcast out. They just don't understand. 